Just wait, just wait. I'm gonna I'm get you. Like, I know you've been training, but you ain't be training as smart and hard as me, bro. I know you ain't. I'm gonna be honest, Joe. I don't like you, but I like what you stand for, okay? Mental, mental illness is a real thing, ladies and gentlemen. And I want this event to showcase, to showcase that anyone who's suffering from mental illness, you are not alone, okay? And you should never, ever, ever give up. I should apologize. I'm sorry. 2017, I made a lot of false promises, not only to people out there on the internet, but also to myself. I said that I would create a lot more, I would be on it, and I failed in every single aspect. I set three or four goals last year and I failed every single one of them outright. I can blame it on multiple things, but in all essence, it's my fault. So to you and also to myself, I'm sorry very much. Just to prove that I've learned from my failures, we've got off to 2018 with a smashing start. This upload schedule is... <laughs> <laughs> Who can I kid? So 2017 was kind of a tough year in a way. Well, you can say that again. <laughs> really? Yes, it's me. Yeah, boy. Anyway, so 2017 was a tough year. I kind of set myself quite a lot of expectations, expectations. and to be honest with you, I didn't deliver on any of them. Can I just talk, please? Like, I'd appreciate that. This is possible. Cheers. Thanks. No problems. So... It's kind of hard when you're just there. Here? Like here? Or there? Or here? So I kind of set myself a lot of expectations to deliver. Mm. Can you just, just, just stop, please? Somebody's Jesus. Touchy. Touchy. I set myself a lot of expectations, and to be honest with you, I'm gonna make a promise now to you as my viewer, and thank you for watching Do so far, that I will promise to upload a lot more keep, this year. Baby. Ah! Oh. Can you relax, please? Actually, no, Ooh. please, can you leave? Me? Leave! What did I do? Mm, leave. Boy, oh, so angry, goodbye. Thank you. In all honesty, though, I shouldn't make promises which I can't keep, and that is something which I've majorly learned from. But just before we get to the main bulk of this whole entire video, three quick things which I wanted to talk about. First of the three being, I finished university, so... No more distractions. Number two, I've been doing music and you will be seeing music throughout the next year. Yeah, I've got lots of ideas and I can't wait to show you guys. And the last point, I went to Poland. And just because I should really have shown this video a few months back, but life got in the way, here's a small little montage of my time in Krakow, Poland. Bathroom. Bed. Hi. This is a tree. This is a mushroom. This is a dragon. Rawr. Anyway, the whole point of this video is about JJ and Joe Weller. But really, who do I think is going to win? Personally, me, I think JJ will win. Because I know JJ personally, I'm definitely rooting for him. It's like, if it's anyone, you, you're you going to pick your friend, aren't you? Like, realistically speaking. I was speaking to Ethan the other day, and he was saying to me, yeah, Charlie, it's a smart dress, smart dress code. I said, what, what do you mean? I'm going, I've got, I've got myself a three-piece suit and everything. I said, <sighs> my face. All right, well, let's go through what I can wear. Well, here goes nothing. Uh, not really it really, is it? I mean, it's a lovely hoodie, but uh, not really kind of appropriate for the scene. Let's go again. I'm feeling this. I like it. Um, let's have a look and see what else we've got anyway. One more, one more. Red card. Automatic sending off, red card, red card, red card, red card. So just as I'm about to enjoy this event, I hope that you enjoy this video with me. It's gonna be a great event. I can't wait to share it with you. I can't wait to experience it. Let's get the video started. I don't know about you, but I know that so many people, including myself, are pumped. I can't wait to get this. I'm just gonna go now. I know I should have done this 
Box. All right, so we've arrived here at Cobble Box, and to be honest, hi guys. Yeah. So now that I've just got here, I'm gonna check to see what people's predictions of the fight are gonna be in three, two, one. JJ. JJ. It's gotta be JJ. Easy. What's the question? Team JJ. Prediction then. JJ. Round three. With a predict, with a round and everything. How many rounds? JJ in like round one, two, three, four, five, or six. What? <laughs> I think Joe, round four, knocked out by KSI. So I've got to back JJ on this one. Yeah. I think he's going to take it. I think he might even stop Joe. Because the hate they have for each other, he might knock him out. I reckon JJ is going to win. I reckon it's going to go to duration. I reckon it's going to be a good fight from both of them. Okay, there's going to be a knockdown in the second round, but it's going to go all the way to points. Yeah. And whoever got the knockdown is going to win. Uh, JJ, stoppage, fourth round. Yo, basically, I think that JJ is going to knock out Joe Weller in three rounds. Three. Three rounds. Three. Three. JJ, fourth round, knockout. Boom. Um, fourth round, knockout. Joe will knock out JJ. I'm very confident. We're a few minutes away from the big bout. JJ, knock him down in round four. And then he's going to go on and get on points. JJ in five. JJ, JJ in five. That's my guy. He's got it. He's got it. TK over JJ in the fifth round. Come on, bro. JJ's my boy. It's JJ, in it. He's gonna bang it. He's got to. He's got to. One round. I'm back. Just a quick apology before we get into the interview. My friend was helping me film. He doesn't work with cameras very often and the whole thing is out of focus. So if you can get over the fact that the video is out of focus, the content itself is actually quite decent. Let's go into the interview. All right, it's been a little bit of a time, but we're back at the Olympic Stadium, which is my home. I've got a little bit of an exclusive interview, which I'm going to have with JJ right now. It's like a press conference kind of thing, like all that kind of stuff. You, you can kind of like give it out like that. Yeah, of you, course. Can say, you can say like- Yeah, for me, it's all about entertaining, entertaining. Obviously, like with yeah, Joe, I want to, I want to, I want to, you know, get at him because like he was pissing me off with the whole As press conference and all that. So I wanted to get my own back, and then, and then yeah, I was just like, yo, just wait, just wait, I'm, a, I'm gonna get you. Like I know you've been training, but you won't be training as smart and hard as me, bro. I know you ain't. But you need to train smart. Like he, you, like fam, you saw with the Fitbit thing. Yeah. You saw how much this guy destroys it on Fitbit. We all got Fitbits. Bam, Even bam. my cameraman right now has got a Fitbit. Legit. When it comes to working hard, like I understand that you've got it. But when you're actually in the gym, yeah. and Vidal, obviously, as your trainer, like, what's he doing to make you push to the, the next level? So Fitness is a hard thing to keep motivated. Yeah. It's. <laughs> I think that's a very good question, and for me, I think it's just. I guess reaching the next level. Yeah. Just like seeing this and seeing this whole event come about just because of me and Joe. It's insane. So it is I'm incredible. Just like, it's incredible. What can I do? Like, that's why I want, want to call it Joe, uh, Logan Paul, Jake Paul, because I'm like, looking at that, that could be insane. Like, yeah, it would be insane. Apparently, it's the next level. For me, it's all about reaching the next level. Like, it's just sick what we've done. Like, as usual, is like to do this. Apparently, our fucking card, the whole card was more entertaining than the Chamberlain versus, uh, what's his name? Lawrence fight. All right, 
So we're going to our final question anyway. Like, what is next for you anyway? Like, I, I know that you're always, you're always planning for the your, world your is my visionary. oyster. Whatever I want, bro. Whatever you want. Whatever I want. All whatever right. I put my mind to. That's it. So if I want to, if I want to be good at ice skating, I fucking be give good me at a ice little skating. pretty little dance on the floor. If I want to do ballet. I will be good at ballet. Right. <laughs> JJ, that's ballet. It was nice to see you, man. Oh, likewise, man. Love, anyway. Always, bro. Always, man. That's going to conclude my vlog, anyway. I'm going to peace it out right now. My and you're going to take two. <laughs> so, it's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. But to sign us out, we've got Darcy and Tamika to say what? Charles is a dickhead. Charles is a dickhead. Bye. Have a good day.